It's Friday night. It's half past 11 at night. I've been at a friend's house all evening after work, which is really nice. And Alex has been pottering around here. And Heidi's gone on holiday with my parents, so we're sad there's no boo this weekend, but she will be away when we go away. So that's easier because it's not sad to say goodbye. And yeah. And we've got a three day weekend because it's bank holiday, which is brilliant. And we have eight days till Disney. Yay! Can you see the sign there? I'm not sure you can. I can't zoom in on this camera while it's recording now. But trust me, the countdown is eight days. Um, so, because I want some content whilst we're away, I've filmed and scheduled most of my content to go out whilst we're away. But one of the things I am doing is I'm going to do a weekly vlog next week. Um, so, because it's Bank Holiday Monday, it'll show the Monday and then like before and after work and stuff until our last day before Disney, which is brill. And that's the plan. Tomorrow morning, I'm going to town early. I'm going to meet a friend for brunch, do a little bit of shopping, and then we're supposed to have friends coming over tomorrow afternoon for a barbecue, but I have a feeling they're going to cancel. Did you hear that? What? I have a feeling they might cancel. What? Natalie and Stuart. Why? Have they, do they have a reply? Yeah, they replied saying, what time do you want us? Mm. And I said, any after any time after two, and I've not heard anything back. They're, these friends of ours are notorious for cancelling. Like, notorious, it happens all the time. They so, will you don't think they will? Yeah, I don't. No, I'd, I would be surprised if they cancel, because usually we always go to theirs. Always. Because they have, like, a thousand pets. It's like a kind of... Although I did, because they've just got, yeah, anyway. Um, so we'll see. And then on Sunday, we're going to Harry Potter Studios, which we were supposed to go to a few weeks ago, but I got really, really, really sick, and so we couldn't go. Um, so I don't want to jinx it. Hopefully I'm not going to get sick again. If I am, then I'm never going to Harry Potter, because clearly I'm severely allergic to it. But you never know. So I'll take you around as much as I can this weekend, but I wanted to do a separate vlog for Harry Potter as well. So that's not gonna be included in this weekend vlog, but um, that's the plan, basically. And are you gonna say hello? Hello. That's nice. And that's that. So I hope you guys all had a good week and good Friday night. I'm really tired, because it's past my bedtime. And I think Right, have a bath and then go to bed. And up bright, up bright, up, up and early in the morning. Can't speak. Crazy. Um, so I'll see you guys in a second. But for me, it will be tomorrow morning. Bye. Morning, everyone. Just getting ready to go into town, but I ordered some stuff from Azos last night, or yesterday, or two nights ago, and I got it yesterday, and I don't like it, so it's going back. I got those glasses that Alex has got. And this top by Surf Gypsy, which is like a bardo shoulderless top, but it's just really, really short. Oh, I'm keeping these panda eyes. They're supposed to reduce puffiness. I thought I'd try them on the plane. And I'm going to keep... I just got this as a present for my friend. They, it's a makeup bag with catacorns, mixed between a cat and a unicorn and a mermaid. And I am obsessed with unicorns and she's obsessed with cats. So that's that logic there. Um, and that's it. So I'm just going to fill in the return form. Oh, and Alex got a t-shirt, but he's packed it. We just got into town and I want to go get a bra and um, a bikini top. And Alex is coming with me. Much to his displeasure. Oh, hey, look at all the Harry Potter shirts. Interesting. All right, so we're gonna go. We just finished at the bra shop and it was very nice. Did you enjoy the experience? It was interesting. Interesting experience. 
everyone's very friendly in there and we weren't in there for very long 15 minutes and I tried on a couple of bikini tops and got my bra that I wanted but I'll show you guys everything I bought probably not my bra but I'll show you my bikini top later I love it it's so pretty so pretty it doesn't look very pretty on the hanger but I think because I'm quite pale as a person and my fair hair it goes really nicely so I'm pleased but I'm not wearing it as a bikini top I'm wearing it underneath tops that are slightly see-through and I'd rather people see or see a bikini top than a bra. And now we're gonna go to Boots and get our final bits for holiday! Yay! A week today we'll be... On the plane? No. No, we won't be on the plane. We'll be at the gate, probably. Probs, probs, probs. Hopefully if nothing's gone wrong. Fingers crossed. <laughs> okay, I just finished at the tanning shop and my friend is due to come. So I'm gonna have brunch with her. Do a little bit of shopping and see you after. Hello, I just got back from town. I had a really, really nice morning with my friend and I'll show you guys what I bought with her. But Alex and I have just been to Sainsbury's to get some food for our barbecue, even though it's absolutely peeing it down with rain and it's thundery and stuff. When our friends come over, they haven't cancelled yet, so I'm thinking they're coming, but I'll show you the food we got because we don't ever usually get food like this like as many treaties as we've got. So I'll just show you, don't know if this will be interesting to you, but we've got some Key Lime Slime Twinkies Ghostbusters, because we love Twinkies and these were half price and they're kind of cool with the green stuff. And then we got crisps for like nibbles for later when they've come. And these are mix ups, so they've got Doritos, Monster Munch, French fries, and what's it? And we got that meaty and cheese flavour. Because my friend's a vegetarian, so I don't know if she can have meaty. I don't know if that's a really ignorant question. And then we've got burger buns for our vegetarian burgers. Alex went to Waitrose earlier on to get some of the stuff to make the burgers, which I'll show you guys later. Um, I got some serene just for breakfast for next week. Up courgettes because they were really nice on the barbecue the other day. I'm obsessed with these pretzel pieces. My favourite flavour is the the barbecue wings. This like they're kind of spicy. They didn't have them, so they only had this, and I just had to get them. And then just got some butter. The butter I like. I like to put it in the thing. We've got this cheesecake. How amazing! This is in the frozen section, and you leave it to defrost in the fridge for four hours. And then if they don't want cheesecake, then we've got some ice cream, dairy milk, and Oreo. Then I got two bottles of this apple and elderflower by Capella, which is really yummy juice. I'm obsessed with blood orange, and they didn't have any anywhere in Sainsbury's apart from in this San Pellegrino. And then I got some sweet corn for the burgers as well. Some halloumi burger cheese for the vegetarian burgers. Oh, I've been stupid. I got, also got these for the burgers, but we don't need double cheese. So people can either have the applewood, which is kind of like a smoky cheese, or the halloumi burgers. And then another capella. And that is it. That is it. So we're going to put this away. And then I'll show you what I got whilst I was shopping with my friend. Yeah. We've just discovered our roof is leaking. Um, we didn't know, but it's obviously been going for a while, but in our larder here, where we... I don't know if you can see, but there's that corner there is completely sodden. But I don't know if that's a problem, because it looks like water's been dripping down here. Because I we put this can of chickpeas, if you see all that water, there a couple of hours ago, and it's just full of water, which is how I knew there was a leak there. And apparently all the shelves are really wet. Alex is having a look at the roof outside, but I, there's nothing obvious. I don't know if it's something wrong with the lead flashing or we can't see a slip tile, or maybe it just happens when it really, really rains, but it's clearly quite a hole. But Alex is on a ladder. This is the roof. So luckily it's quite a low roof. Uh, let me go inside and I'll tell you when the water runs through. Actually, how am I gonna tell you that? You'll see the water. Yeah, but how am I going to tell you it's coming through? I can hear you. What, from here? Yeah. From in there? That's where the problem is. Well, if I, shall I open this side door and then... No, I can hear, definitely hear you. It's just in one glass. You can hear me because I've got a loud voice. So we'll probably have to get a guy out next week because Reeves are not Alex's, or my speciality. 
but Alex is going to run a hose on it so we can see. My friends are texting me they're going to be here in 20 minutes <laughs> and I've not started making the burgers and we haven't finished tidying up before they get here but if there's a leak. Oh yeah look it looks really bad. Shows you how often we come out to the shell. Looks like the problem's from there or I don't know, can't really see any leak stones. I really need to clean out this shelf at some point. This is a job for some stage. Mm. Okay, this is gonna be the quickest haul ever because my friends are due any second and I haven't made vegetarian burgers. Um, but this is the bikini top I got from Bravissimo, which I absolutely love. Like when it was on the hanger, I wasn't too enamored by it, but on oh, it looks so cool. I love these straps here and it's so comfortable and supporting. So love that. So I got that from Bravissimo and that was, sorry, I don't know why you're looking. Um, that was 34 pounds. So that was quite pricey, turns out. And I'm just going to do this randomly. So I went to pay to pay. No, I didn't. I went to Scribbler with um, my friend to get some birthday cards for Alex. Um, so I got him this one from Heidi, which my friend found, and that's absolutely perfect. And then this one from me. Big love on your birthday and a kiss. Um, but it's quite stressful looking for cards. Oh, and they were £2.75 for the Black Labrador and £2.65 for that one. And then I had to get this unicorn from Paper Chase. How cool is this dude? Love him. He's just a little plush unicorn and he was £10. Was he? Yeah, £10 or €14 Euros, because it comes in Euros, so why not tell you? And then, oh my god, my friend is so sweet. So she ran off to the till and then ran over and gave me this. She bought me this. How cute is that? Keep calm and colour unicorns. So this is a colouring book with unicorns in and other things. And I'm going to do this on the plane. I've never thought I'd get a colouring book and do it, but as I've been given one, and I love unicorns, I've done that. So, in conjunction with that, I got some colour-scented pencils, which are smencils. So apparently these pencils smell of cherry, black cherry, bubble gum, blah, blah, blah. So I'll use these on the plane. I'm not going to open them up and smell them before. Actually, I might do, let's be honest. And then from Paper Chase, what else did I get? Oh, I got this card for my friend because it's her birthday. And I got uh, to go along with that makeup bag I showed you from ASOS this morning. Um, I'm just going to do this in random order, you guys, because it's all in the same bag as you have to pay for bags nowadays. I got this summer survival kit from Marks and Spencers, which is by Philip Kinsley. And it was £25. It says it's worth £30, but I ended up getting it for £20 because I had an offer on my Sparks card. And I love Philip Kinsley. It is, without a doubt, the best hair products I've ever bought, but it's a little bit on the expensive side, so I only use it to really condition my hair. But I thought as I was going around holiday, I'd get this. Sorry if I'm talking really quickly. And this comes with a swim cap, daily damage defense, and maximizer. So I'll definitely be taking this away with me to Florida. And I love that. And then I got this mascara from Boots, which is Rimmel London Volume Colorist, which apparently over the course of two to six weeks, it gradually dyes your lashes anyway. Um, and it was in the Daily Mail, which is a newspaper I don't really like to admit I read in the mornings, but it's such a good app on your phone. And I like all the showbiz stuff on it more than the actual day-to-day -day of the news bit, because I think they're a bit biased. Um, and it came up as like being a really good mascara, got really good ratings, basically. And then I got this novelty eye ice cream, I was going to say, unicorn mask for the Halloween party in Disney that we're going to, which is great. I'd already have a headpiece with a little nubbin uh, horn on it, but I thought this is a little mask for me. Why not? That was from Paper Chase, sorry. And that was £7. And the mascara was... Um, five pounds it was reduced from 7.99 and then oh my friend and i we wanted let me open this i know i've no idea my friend and i that i went with this morning i work with her and we wanted matching mugs at work so we both got this owl mug in lime green which kind of looks like a pineapple and i love that 
and she loves owls so it's like the perfect hybrid for us and that was eight pounds there and then it smells of burning in here i wonder why i think it's because i turned on the lamp for the first time god sorry i'm in a real panic and then from boots i also got this face mask hello you okay yeah I'll show you these ones. Oh, we've done two seconds. Okay. Um, I also got this face mask, which is five pounds by L'Oreal. It's a pure clay purity mask, face mask, 10 applications. I really like my Rodal face mask. I use it once a week. Um, but I think I just wanted to have a go and try something else because there could be something better out there. And I like L'Oreal makeup products. So I got that. And then I got a oh, um, small Smashbox primer, which I always wear. This is ultimately my favorite mascara, so I got this, which is the False Volume Express by Maybelline in black waterproof. And then I got um, the L'Oreal Makeup Wipes for my travel, so I don't have to take my micellar water. This is like my micellar water on a wipe, so that's brilliant. And that is everything, and now I need to pack this all away and um, help Alex finish tidying and then make the vegetarian burgers before my friends come in probably about two minutes time. Okay, so my a colleague of mine gave me this recipe. It's a vegetarian burger, because <clears throat> my friend's vegetarian. So it's a tin of chickpeas, tin of sweet corn, two tablespoons of flour, some hummus, and I put in some chili and some salt and pepper. And apparently it makes nice vegetarian burgers, but I'm not actually so sure about that. But we'll see, I'll let you guys know once we eat them. And you blitz it in the food processor. But I'm gonna say bye, because our friends are supposed to be coming any minute now. And so I'll see you after they've gone. And yeah, see you then, bye. I'm having a Percy Pig. It's a veggie Percy Pig and it really gets stuck in your teeth. Our friends are just gone. We couldn't have a barbecue because it was raining raining so we just did everything on the argo but it was really nice did you enjoy it yeah there he is but they've got <laughs> they've gone um quite early but i think it was nice wasn't it yeah oh my god we had the most amazing amazing oh our veggie burgers didn't really taste of anything i wouldn't recommend them but the others said they liked them but this was like the highlight of the night. Everyone loved this. <laughs> Alex is going mental. <laughs> this is really good. But they've gone so we can relax. We've had non-stop, well I've had a well we both have had non-stop days today. What are you doing? <laughs> Alex is a little bit hyper on something. What are you doing? I'm drinking. <laughs> He's high on rose lemonade. There's no alcohol in there, by the way. He's just a little bit, a little bit hyper from laughing too much this afternoon. I'm just walking back and forth here. I want to lock the kitchen door, but I need. We're walking. <laughs> Have you had any beers? No. No, you just had too many sweets. <laughs> this is just what we get. I'm gonna hide you. Alex, stop following me. It's creepy. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> it's really Stop it, I'm getting really freaked out now. I'm scaring myself. <laughs> it's like Chucky. Chucky the doll. <laughs> it's really creepy. You're like a creepy child. <laughs> or a movie. I don't know why. I don't think we had that much for supper because I know we had cheesecake. I'm gonna go and get something to eat, I think. I think I want an ice cream. <laughs> um, and I might watch some Modern Family because I'm loving that at the moment. So I'll see you guys tomorrow probably. Night, bye. Good morning everyone. Today's probably the first time I've worn makeup on a weekend vlog in a very long time, but I have tomorrow off as it's bank holiday and I thought I wouldn't wear makeup then, so I'm still having two days off 
although not technically this week, I suppose. But um, I'm just going to sort through all the stuff that I bought yesterday and pack the last bits. We've moved all our luggage into this room now because no one's going to stay here before we go. And so I'm just going to sort out those last bits and that's it really. Have some breakfast. And then we're going to go to... I've got to get some shampoo and stuff from Boots yesterday, which is slightly annoying as I was there. So I need to go back. And then we're going to go to John Lewis in High Wycombe because it's a nice John Lewis. And I need... I want some stuff by philosophy. I went into Boots yesterday to get that and they didn't have anything. It was like the apocalypse at philosophy, at the philosophy counter. And then we're going to Harry Potter Studios, but I'm doing that in a different vlog, so you won't see that in this one. Um, so, that's the plan. We just got back from town, I'll show you what we got quickly. I got these awesome um, post-it notes, sticky notes, which are so cool, I love them. I always write on sticky notes because it doesn't move anywhere when you write on it, and this is massive, so that's great. And then I got myself some shampoo and conditioner by John Frieda. I use this all the time, and I've used this, and I really like it just for a bit of a break. It's Dove Oxygen Moisture Shampoo. And then this was on offer, so I thought I'd try it because it kind of looks like the Dove L'Oreal LV, and it was like half the price for double the amount. And then from Marks and Spencer, we just got some fruit and some chewy mint. Oh, and some fruit sherbets. And then from WH Schmidt, I got some food for the plane. I went a bit overboard actually, because, you know, I got my pretzel pieces. I got some randoms and fruit pastel and juicy cheese and giant chocolate buttons and Bertie's jelly mix because it was reduced to 50p and I also got these cool earrings from oh and I got a pencil sharpener sharper no from W. H. Smith, and I got these awesome earrings from Claire's accessories. Where are they? There they are. Look, they're little pea pods from Toy Story. Well, they look like that. I know that they're supposed to have three peas in the pod, but it's good enough. And these were three pounds fifty. If it focuses, there we go. And that is what we got. Oh, and I got my boost, which is the whole reason why we went in in the first place. And I know we went in to get my shampoo. So that is what we got. And we're going to go to John Lewis soon. Probably soon. And then off to Harry Potter World! Yay! We just got to John Lewis and High Wycombe. Here it is. Here we are. And we're going to go in. Oh. Amazing Grace. I'm really excited because they started selling Pusheen in John Lewis. So I got my calendar for next year, Pusheen 2017, which is amazing. And this is all of them on the back which is brilliant, loving it, best calendar ever. And I got a Pushing Weekly Calendar because I use these things, or Weekly Planner, I use these things all the time, so that's brilliant. And then I got two packets of these coasters, one for my friend for her birthday and one for me. And it says on the back, it has these four, if you can see that. And that is what I got. And the two cases were nine pounds each. This was six pounds each, six pounds, and the calendar was ten. But I absolutely adore this calendar. He's the bomb. It's just half an hour. Hey, I just realised I have to say goodbye from my weekend vlog because we're about to get to Harry Potter, and.
and you guys will see that in another vlog and um, I hope you had fun watching our weekend and thank you for watching as always and I'll see you guys soon. Bye! Bye bye. Oh sorry and I forgot to tell you guys that um, I'm going to be doing an extra weekly vlog starting tomorrow Monday and that will be posted um, the Wednesday after we're away yeah. but it's just an extra thing. Oh my god we're here. So excited. Anyway bye!